So the first time you see a scheme program, there's two things that stick out more than anything else. The first is all the parentheses, and the second is that the format of the expressions is a little weird because you have what's called prefix notation. Now, prefix notation is where the operator comes before the operands. So if we have, for example, 3 plus 7, the operator there is the plus symbol. And since we're going to have prefix notation instead of the normal infix notation that you normally see in your math classes, we're going to put the operator at the beginning. And so our operation will look like this. And of course, this is scheme. So we'll put things in parentheses before we evaluate them. So let's open up Dr. Racket and take a look at some of these examples. So if I just say plus three, seven, I get this weird output. It doesn't really do anything. And that's just because I haven't told scheme I want to evaluate it. When you want scheme to evaluate an expression, you put it in parentheses. So plus three, seven, then I get the result of 10. I can also do subtraction, multiplication, or division. In fact, with division, it'll even return a fraction. Now, the number of operands is not limited. I can say plus one, two, three, four, eight. I can multiply seven, three, nine, and 12. I could also say minus eight, and now I, that returns negative eight. If I want to do more than one operation, I can embed those. So I could say plus three times three, minus seven, two, and I get 14. And while strictly speaking, order of operations isn't required when you have prefix notation, just like you would expect if you're used to infix notation and the order of operations, the inner parentheses are evaluated first, and then those results are used in the outer calculation. Now, it's not just mathematical operations that use prefix notation. Later on, when we start writing scheme procedures, those will also use prefix notation. Although if you've seen another programming language in the past, then what scheme is doing with prefix notation is very similar. It's just that the parentheses move around a little bit.